Hey, what's up? Jigzer here. Editing videos doesn't have to be a time-consuming hassle. CapCut templates are making video editing easier to create professional-looking content in minutes. In this video, I'll show the step-by-step -step process of how to use CapCut templates. Let's go. While scrolling through your TikTok for you page, you might encounter a video with a style you like. If the video creator used a CapCut template, they often include a CapCut Try This Template button on the video itself. Tapping this button will automatically open CapCut with the template preloaded. Follow the steps. Insert your photos or videos, then tap Next. And customize the template. You can adjust the frames by dragging them to where you want them to be placed. Also, select a specific media and choose whether to crop the video, replace it, or add filters to it. Once satisfied, save and click the export button above. After exporting the video, CapCut will usually give you the option to share it directly to TikTok or save it to the device. To find one using the CapCut app, launch it first on your mobile device. Look for the templates option, usually located at the bottom of the screen. You can scroll through the various template categories or use the search bar at the top to find specific templates. Tap on the template you want to use. You'll be able to see a preview of the template and how it might look with your own content. Click on the Use Template button. The same process with TikTok. You'll be prompted to select photos or videos from your gallery to replace the placeholders in the template. Once your media is added, you can further edit by adjusting the files you added. You can't fully edit a template because the animation style and overall layout are locked in. Some creators will only let you replace the placeholder content like photos, videos, and text, and make minor adjustments like font or color, but the underlying design remains the same. When you're happy with the video, tap on the export button to save it to your device. Okay, if I've been able to assist you, I would really appreciate it if you could leave a thumbs up and subscribe. And if you enjoy taking photos and videos with your iPhone, please visit my website. Over the last few months, I've created a video course where I've gathered the best tips and tricks on how to make the most out of your iPhone for photography. You'll find the link to the website in the video description. Until next time, bye!